In the 1950s, the British wanted to develop a surface-to-air missile to replace their Bofors 40mm anti-aircraft guns. Ultimately, the British developed a highly reliable air defense weapon, the Light Sword surface-to-air missile, which entered service in 1971. It has been equipped by more than a dozen countries. Iran once wanted a self-propelled version of the Light Sword missile, and thus developed the tracked version of the Light Sword surface-to-air missile system. The Light Sword is a highly integrated surface-to-air missile system. It uses search radar to locate targets, and then uses line-of-sight radar guidance to lock onto the target. The operator uses a sighting device mounted on a universal joint to aim and track the target, providing the missile with good accuracy. The launcher mounts the missiles on the left and right sides, with a total of four missiles for the two-wheeled, towed version. Although the original Light Sword missile system had shortcomings such as no night combat capability and short operational range, it remains a very reliable point defense weapon. The British later upgraded it, using new missiles to increase the range and changing to radar tracking mode, giving it day and night combat capability. At that time, Iran was interested in the Light Sword surface-to-air missile system and proposed to install the missile system on a mobile chassis to create a self-propelled anti-aircraft vehicle. However, this weapon system has not been successfully developed. Due to changes in the domestic situation in Iran, the order was abandoned, and the order was successfully converted from export to domestic sales. The mobile missile system uses the M548 track chassis, which is developed by the FMC company based on the M113 armored personnel carrier. The front of the vehicle has a spacious driver's cab and missile system operation room, while the missile launcher and guidance radar are mounted on the rear deck. The launcher can rotate horizontally to aim in different directions. This vehicle-mounted version can carry eight missiles at a time, providing greater combat capability. The optical tracking device is installed in the front driver's cab, on the right side, and needs to be raised when in use. The driver's cab has an air conditioning system and has armored protection and NBC protection capabilities. There are no self-defense weapons on the vehicle, but smoke grenade launchers are installed on both sides of the front of the vehicle. The track light sword surface-to-air missile system has a very high operational efficiency, taking only 30 seconds from the driving state to being ready to fire, compared to the 15 minutes needed for the old towed version. However, this system also has the drawback that it cannot carry spare missiles, and an ammunition vehicle is needed for combat operations. The British Army received the first set of tracked light sword surface-to-air missile systems in 1981, producing a total of 50 sets. During combat, each launch vehicle needs to be equipped with an ammunition vehicle converted from the M548, in addition to carrying spare ammunition, it also carries one rescue personnel, as well as some food, drinking water, and other supplies. The tracked light sword surface-to-air missile system has not been involved in actual combat since entering service, but the towed version has been used in the South Atlantic and the Middle East, reportedly shooting down a variety of Air Force equipment, including the Tu-22. Given the technological conditions at the time, it is believed that the combat capability of the self-propelled system would not be inferior.